Hey everybody, Mike here from Human Under Bridge and thank you so much for tuning in. Thank you for subscribing for those of you who have subscribed and thank you for watching the videos. Please do subscribe and click the like button if you do like this video. I'm really excited about today's video. It is all about Alexander Township. This video is actually the third video that I've recorded but the first one that I want to drop on my channel because it is all about an interview with Tate Linda Twala the father of Alexandra, an awesome human being and philanthropist that has dedicated his life to the Alexandra community. I've been spending a lot of time in Alexandra for the last few months alongside my business partner and brainchild of the Awe Initiative, Greg Harrison, and we have partnered with Linda Twala and the We Love Alex Project as well as the Linda Twala Foundation in order to bring some awesome new tools to Alexandra through our application and through our crime fighting initiative that includes the Alexander Patrollers. This interview you will hear from Linda Twala himself about issues that are currently besetting Alexandra and the community. Issues such as crime, issues such as domestic violence, issues such as substance abuse, specifically alcohol and drug abuse, issues in terms of housing, issues in terms of unemployment, issues in terms of just the lack of space that the community has in terms of not being able to grow and the minimal amount of land that is available for the community. I have exciting news and that exciting news is that we have launched our first street poll in the Alexandra community on 13th Avenue with a lot of thanks to Lawrence Ruele Lawrence is Tate Linda's right-hand man and the vice chairman of the We Love Alex project and has also dedicated his life to the upliftment of the community. That poll includes a PTZ camera and two fixed cameras as well as audio and video feeds and a solar-powered lighting system. We want to roll these polls out into the Alex community and we're really excited about sharing this with you and please support the Awe initiative, please support the We Love Alex project as well as the Linda Twala Foundation. Details for all will be below in the description of the video. I would like to thank everyone in the Alex community for making us feel so at home and for embracing the Awe initiative. I love Alex. I really love Alex. It grows on you and we hope that Alexandra the township, the community will become a place that is representative of the awesome people that live in Alexandra. Thank you so much for watching. Thanks for tuning in. You know, when I built these houses, we said for humanity, these houses, in those years, I built these houses to the habitat for humanity, trying to show the government that uh, we can do it as long as we can get, we get support from, from other people. And now we built these houses, people from Centennial areas, they came forth who are experts in building and showed us how to do it through Habitat for Humanity. And our houses are stronger than the RTP houses that were built by the government. But because there are those guys that I can call what's in it for me, we could not take that any further. During the week here, you think it's a Sunday. The unemployment rate in Alexandra is so high. Yeah, you know, when you talk about uh, the employment, that is why we've got patrollers. People are resorting to crime, you know, molesting people so that they can get some money. If you drive around the bridges, 
you'll find people begging for money. Some of these people are educated. One day I'll show you a person, not only uh, one of them is disabled, he hasn't got hands, but at least he's brilliant. Yeah, I'll invite him one day. Maybe we might meet him as we drive around the, the area so that you speak to him. You'll find that these people are thirsty for work and for education and they want to see a change in Alexandria, not only for the parliamentarians but for everybody. We're talking about service delivery. Now, what I'm saying is that uh, whilst we're also trying to to, to, to fight for the United States of Africa. Let us not forget where we come from. Alexandra is mother of all the continents. Alexandra is mother of all the townships. So there's so much that uh, the minute we go out of here, maybe we'll be having other things in mind. Yeah, especially when it comes to giving back to the community. We want you guys to go and be our ambassadors speak to the people, tell them that we need uh, um, uh, we, we need cars, meals on wheels, we need help, we need kimbis, we need all these things because Alexander is called the oldest in Alexander, old, oldest resident. Those that are above 90 to above 100. Yeah. And then we, that is why we've got three committees, a committee of the elephants, the most senior citizen, a committee of the lions, that's our age group, a committee of the leopards, that's the youth group. They've given birth to the cubs, the ones that uh, we they do, who do uh, reading. And that's where they make a mistake. Because they don't feel time to the communities where we are working at grassroots level. Correct. For instance, like Queen Elizabeth, I mean, she's passed on, but we still expect them to come back and plow back, you know, the minerals that they took from South Africa or from Africa mm -hmm. for them to identify organizations. And that can only be done through you guys. We are not going to get tourists in Alex mm. if we're sitting in those offices. Let us give others a chance to do that, even though they are not representing us well. For instance, I was telling the mayor yesterday when he was here, I said, I know that I'm talking to you now, maybe in a week's time or two weeks' time, a month, they'll be kicking out. Now, it's just too much. We need people to come in rescue us in Alexander. We're tired of talking to mayors, different people, but nothing's being done. So who who responds for fires here? Yeah. Mm, I think we have... We, we have disaster management. No. Are there no. any... Good? No. Do they, I presume they also have to take like tankers out? Yeah. Because fire hydrants might not be always available. That's why we, some years back when we built this place, we requested them to come and live here at Second Avenue because they were too far away in, in Sentry. Yeah. And they only left here, some of them, when they get loans, you know, to live around this area. But I'm saying this because we were struggling when there were fire victims, flood victims. Yeah. yeah, name it. There's a lot to be done in Alex. There's so much. What happened to the renewal project, in your view? Well, it collapsed, if I may put it that way. The funds never came available? Uh, we are told there were funds, but then if you're not using those funds, the government, what do they do? say? They take them back. When I saw, let us not forget where we come from. Alexandra is mother of all the continents. Alexandra is mother of all the townships.